my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Sherry. I post new videos every week, and today I have a very exciting video for you. I received this today in the mail. This is a Walt Life box. I ordered this on Tuesday. Today is Saturday. I was shocked when this was in the mailbox, and I am super excited, so I had to sit down and film this like immediately to see what was inside. So I ordered, hold on, I have to look. I ordered the Magic Plus Princess box for a female, 18 plus, um, and it was $49, and I found a coupon code online which saved me $12.25. So with tax, I paid $38.96 for this box. Now I have never had a Walt Life box before. I keep seeing people talking about them. So I thought that I would give it a try and let's see what's inside. Okay. Oh wow. So there is a lot going on in there. Lots of pictures. Looks like Instagram pictures of people with their box. It says, hello adventure. Your treasure awaits. Dig in. Enter to win awesome prizes. Snap. Take a photo with your box, post, post on Facebook, or tag us on Instagram when random winners will be notified. So it says, welcome to the Walt Life family. You joined an exclusive Disney fan club that is here to send you all the Disney fun that you'd ever need. We're excited to curate special boxes every month filled with officially licensed Disney and Disney Parks goodies that are specially chosen with you in mind. We... We're excited to create your happily ever after. Get ready to love our box as much as we love making it. And it looks like, I don't know if it's really a handwritten note. Hi princess, my name is Sarah. I'm happy to introduce myself and as I get to choose your items every month. If you have any issues, please let me know. Cheers, Sarah. So I don't know if that was really handwritten. It's hard to tell. I mean, it's handwriting, but we'll see. Okay, so the first thing that came are Jelly beans, Mickey Mouse jelly beans. These are not gonna last long in my house. Looks like it is just an assortment of jelly beans, but my son loves jelly beans, so that's kind of fun. The second, okay, these are, there's nothing in there. Oh, it looks like there was pens in there. There was a pen in there. And it is a Soren pen. Now, personally, I do not collect pens, but I know a lot of people do, so I think I might be able to trade this, but that is kind of cute. Looks like there's another pen in here, which is for Everest. It's like an old school fast pass. That's really cute, the little old school fast passes. And it looks like these are official Disney pens, so those are kind of cute. And then I see some ears in here, which I carry on these, but they're cute. They are just the black and red ears. I may save these for a giveaway since I do already own them, but they're really cute. And then there's this, which is rather large. I think it's a mug. I don't have scissors, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I opened it up, and I do think it's a mug. It is a mug, let's see. It says, oh, that's cute. It says made in the 90s. And it has all of the Toy Story characters. That's really cute. This does come from the parks, I believe. It is $14.95. And I will definitely use this mug. I was not made in the 90s. A lot older than that. But this is super, super cute. Okay, and then the rest of the stuff. Let's see, it is a Walt Life treasure coin. Collect all eight Walt Life coins and win a trip for two to Disney World. Here's that. Here is a picture of Sarah who uh, did my, my box, dressed up as Belle. Here is a bookmark, Walt Life, an exclusive Disney fan club. It says, I want adventure in the Great White somewhere. Cute. Okay, and then it says, surprise, we're going to surprise three different nurses and doctors who are working on the front lines fighting against COVID-19 with a magical Walt Life gift, with a magical Walt Life box. Nominate someone on the back of this card and post it to our social. So put someone's name on that. That's kind of nice. 
And then we have a postcard, a Pixar postcard. It says for the birds. Oh, that's cute. I like that a lot. The Pixar ball and the lamp. And then it says uh, an exclusive Walt Life Disney fan club. And then on the back it is, I think that's Moana as a baby, baby Moana. And it's a puzzle. So you color it and then you kind of like break it apart. I don't want to break it apart, but I'll have my son color it. That's kind of cute. Inside the box was this little pullout. And then on the back side of that is where you put the little coin that you got. So I got the eye and then it says, collect the word Walt and win a Disney Tsum Tsum Mini. Collect the word life and win a Disney Mini beanbag plush and then if you collect Walt's life you uh, win a trip to Disney World so that's the little game card thing that it came with and it was inside the box okay so what do I think about the box mm, I'm not super impressed how much was it again I have to look I'm sorry it was $49 so I did not pay $49 because I had the discount code, so I paid $36.75, yeah, $36.75. Even $36.75 feels kind of like a lot to me. I mean, the mug was $14.95, which I do love the mug. The ears I already own, which is kind of a bummer, plus I think these ears are from Claire's because I feel like that's where I got mine especially with the tag. I mean, these aren't park ears for sure. So, mm, and then the jelly beans. My son will love the jelly beans, so that's kind of exciting. And then the two pins. Like I said, I'm not a pin collector. I don't trade pens, so I really have no use for them. So maybe for me, this box wasn't great because I already own an item and I don't really enjoy the pins. So maybe I'll be better off sticking with boxes where I can select the items a little bit more because I didn't get to um, really give any preferences for this. So they just kind of gave me items, which is fine. I do kind of like the element of surprise. Honestly, if I would have paid $49 for this box, I would have been disappointed. Tell me what you think. Tell me in the comments below what you think about the box. Was it worth the $49? I know I didn't pay the $49. I only paid $36.75, $25. But if I paid the 49, what do you think? Would you be happy with this box? I don't know. Also tell me in the comments below if you have subscribed to Walt Life Boxes and what you thought what your experience was. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I would love for you to subscribe if you have not already. I post new videos every week. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>